Hello, Contrived Creations. This is Crimson, and you're watching some YS Otho Felkana. I pick up where I left off in these lovely caves after we talked to the mayor. So after talking to the mayor and Father Apia, um, he, they told us to go talk to the master. And on the way to do that, the mummy man appeared and made us fight some furies, which were just harpies. Which is that mini boss in the big bird area. Now we've got to go meet Dogi and get the statue in these mountains. And we also figured out about the, the, the Genos. Well, we didn't really find out anything about that at all, really. Just that the myth in the game that's, you know, in a fantasy setting is, is true, go figure. Um, and, uh, I guess the dark truth of, uh, Genos, Genos, that he, uh, only sealed the evil Galbalon with the statues. I didn't destroy him, really. I have a lot of money. Ah, uh, five. Hey, Dogi, give me the power to break rocks. Hey, yo. What? What are you doing here? Adolf told Dogi about all the events that had led him to the Elder Mountains. Man, you've been busy. The master filled me in on a few things too, and I definitely think we need to get all the statues before McGuire does. But as you can see. You seem to have reached an impasse. Like a big ass gorge kind of impasse. <laughs> yeah, big ass. I can fly. Can you give me the ability to break rocks? Give me the ability to break rocks, Dogie. I've searched everywhere else. So I figure out room statue must be somewhere on the other side. But you wouldn't know it. You'd have to be able to fly to get over there. There's gotta be a way. Nice moves, Adolf. Only problem is, they don't help me in the slightest. I can't possibly join you. Guess you'll have to go it alone from here. But before you do, there's something I meant to give you. Here, catch. The brown bracelet of rock blanking. Thank you. Earth bracelet. Terra bracelet. Um, body slams you into a target at impossible speed. Body impervious to damage during use. Oh, I get to I get to do the charge. Oh, awesome! I like topaz. I ran across it while searching the mountains. I noticed that it looked like the other two bracelets you were using, so I figured I'd hold on to it for you. All right, show stealer. I won't hold you up any longer. I can tell you're raring to go. Good luck, man. I'll be waiting right here for you. Bored, stupid. So make sure you hurry back, okay? You're gonna destroy my voice, there, Dogie. We oh I don't get to fly with you. Eh. That's a little lame. But hey, I can break all those rocks that were like, hey, I'm a rock, break me. I don't think I wanna go back just yet. Or at least I'll I'll find a save point, then go back before fighting the boss. And uh, I'll spend all my money. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming up here is going to be a level two uh, a gem. I notice that you can find gravel ore from enemies dropping there. All right. Thank you. So what have we here? Uh, bees. Covered in bees. Stingy, stingy, shooty bees. Health I don't need. Uh, whoop. Well, nope. Apparently I fell. Um, I, I fell. That's what they say about it. I, I think I've been here before. Have I? Where did you put me, game? Ah, uh, really, really. Oh, really? I hate you so much right now, game. It's not like normal ice physics. It's. Because we said so, ice physics. Thank you. Uh, the, the slopes that I'm going up seem to have more to do with it than what I'm actually doing. Am I free? Am I even going the right way? Why did I... Where? Okay, so this is somewhere new. Neat. Oh, here is uh, above the entrance. Aha. So I wonder what was down then, if this is up. Wait, wait. There's still further up we can go. 
Yep. Alright, what are you hiding up here, game? I know you're... you're... ah! Slow physics. Alright, let's try that one again. I wonder if they want me to use the rock that they gave me. Or just... Be, oh no! Okay, I'll just arrest my momentum with the flight. Or not. I'll get you. I will not be thwarted by a slope. Uh huh. Uh. No. <sighs> I hate this ice so much. Ice, I, you hate me. Hate of you, ice. Snow. Ice, icy snow. Slippy, slidey, slow going. Completely removing the movement of a game that I, I personally believe is one of the main factors of a game that makes it enjoyable is how you move around it. So is here, is here fighting anything? Is it just another area that I would fall to? Oh, it was hiding something. I knew it. Ow. That was... Wow. Stone shoes, so I can stop slipping, I see. That just... Alright. There. Ah. Awfully contrived. I guess it was my fault for, uh... Using the tactics I was using to get around, but... Not to deal with this ice anymore. Because I got a contrived MacGuffin. Of don't obey ice physics anymore. Although, something is there to be said about how I managed to get past it without... I'll be, give me, give me broccoli please. No, no broccoli for you. I don't like these rocks. They have way too much health. And do too much damage and can't just be hit. You have to uh, time when you attack them in. And the gravel ore. But health. Well, I'll take the health. Alright, so. Um, go here. Whoops, I didn't want to fight you. But hey, I got shoes now so I can do this. And then can make my jump. I don't need to, need to fire this. Um, gravel ore. All that for ore. I hate you, game. I hate you so. Tell me I didn't just fall again. I just fell again. Wait, wait, this bee might have health for me. Bee? You had nothing. The bees! They do nothing! Hey, run, at least. You know, I don't have to deal with dice anymore, really. Can't hold buttons. You know, I'll just I'll just let go of it then. So I don't really think I'm gonna be fighting anything until that bee at the end of this zone area. More of an area than a zone. Oh, I'll fight you. And I don't, don't need the spinny thing to kill you. I don't like you rock things. No one does. You jerks. And you bees are lovely. Give me tons of gold or an XP. Alright, I'm just gonna try to jump this way. I already have what's up there. Ah, oh, there we go. That was lovely. Yeah. Well, now I'm at full health. Alright. And I don't have to slip and slide anymore. Oh, and I can go up here. Whatever may or may not be up here. And they're dropping their loot off the edges. No Z-axis! Oh, no. No, Z-Axis! No, I don't want to fall again. <laughs> Why, Z-Axis? Why can't you be a good guy? Scumbag Z-Axis. I don't even want you. Just get me out of here. So I can fall again. Really what I want to do is, I want to find a save point. And use my third rock baking bracelet to go back to all the other zone or areas and uh, get all the loot. That's really what's on my mind right now. Along with hitting buttons I don't intend to. Always on my mind. And not falling in the same holes over and over again would be nice too. Uh, I should have saved that, whatever. I'll, I'll get you. Didn't get you to spawn another enemy that time. Uh, did the broccoli die for Yeah. Off screen, means it ceases to exist. Okay, so. I don't, yeah, I'll, 
I'll probably use that little walk thing that was been worthless to me. Yeah. Make sure I don't have any ranged attacks harassing me while I'm trying to get up here. You're you're kidding, right, game? Uh Well, aha! Aha! Uh, I had to track. Oh, really? Wait, wait. Maybe, maybe this is right. All right. See, I don't like it when it asks me to use the z-axis because the camera angle is based on the x and y with the left and right 2D and the 3D. Now, the z-axis is basically an illusion, but when they make use of it, then they don't give you the option to change the camera. It's it's rough. It's difficult to manage. I don't like crab things. They're you know, like uh, rocks with too much health that don't get uh, staggered. Okay, I wonder what that hole was. A shortcut maybe, or just more getting stuck down someplace. A hole to fall in. That other hole. Oh, was a short. Yep, maybe. Let's find out. Now, are you hiding loot from me, game? No, that's just the hole. Alright. So I assume it's gonna say you have to backtrack because that hole exists. No, we're out of the ice. Um, bees? I really think that they would want to hide something behind these destructible icicles. Just not seeing it. Oh, we got... Did we get two health from that level? Is that what I'm seeing? Okay, I'm being careful here. Oh, what are you? Oh, you're just a pig man. Um, get all these walls. Oh, there's a rock breaking point. Oh, and there's also a vice face boss breakable thing over there. What? What camera? Am I doing that? My button mashing. Aha, chest. No! I hate you so much, Kim. Ah, uh, so I couldn't move because uh, I looted the chest. So I had no control of my character. And because I bumped into the chest, even though I'm wearing my iron boots, I managed to slip off that edge. Whatever. Whatever. Take, take that, base boss. Jerk. You. Okay, so that was where I was. And was essentially meaningless. So, uh, was there another way to go? Am I missing something here? I don't think I am. Yeah, I'm not. Pretty sure I'm not missing where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. This was way back when. Yeah, no. Oh, oh. Alright, I see it. I see the ruse game. What you're hiding from me. Although it's probably not even what I'm thinking. Not required to progress, really, but still there. Oh, it's just a chest. With more mountains of ore that I'm swimming in. And hey, I've, I'm also swimming in gold from going through the same place a couple of times, so... I'll be able to... buy that final sword that sold in the shop. And upgrade it to the max, like, immediately. Um, so where else is there in this cave to go? Not here? Wait. No, definitely not here. Uh, where, where can I go? No holes there to go in. Nothing there. So somewhere up. For sure. Uh, over? Let's go with over. Okay, nothing. This is just a boss face. Breakable for loot item. Why are ice crabs shooting bubbles? How do they keep those bubbles warm? When there's it's cold enough to crystallize whatever this is. Whatever. 
Uh, maybe I was supposed to fall here? Nope. That was not right. No, Pigman. Since you're the one of your kind around here, I'll, I'll kill you. And you things are impervious to damage, so I'm not even going to bother with you. Be I'll, I'll kill you, Beam. Uh, I'll hit you a couple of times, Beam Monster. So make the jump. So last time I went with going down there. And pretty much the only way to go. Oh, I can also break those like that. Heat. So nothing hiding there. Oh, did I not go this way, Big Man? Um. It's weird, weird for you to squeak, Big Man, when I murderize you. Okay, those, so, so these both kind of seem like pathways. But also not really. Um, aha! There we go. Alright, what, what do we got here? More crab monsters? Okay, I jump. I don't want to fight crabs. I don't, they're jerks. Um... Yeah, whatever. Uh, I'll assume that they're yeah, definitely hiding something back here. You still attack me even though I was hitting you, you jerk. More, more gold. I'm just all of a sudden I've reached this tier and I've, I've got more gold than I could ever possibly spend. I guess I could start buying those uh, revives if I die. I wonder if it heals me to full. Would be lovely. Save save time on difficult boss fights. Although with that, since I don't think it really gives me the option to use it or save it, maybe it'll give me the option of equipping it, uh, as opposed to just using it if I have it in my inventory. I'll get to decide when I purchase that. There's a death fall with spikes. Lovely. I want to fall into that again. Now, you, you with your impervious to damage this, I, I'll, I'll assume I'm supposed to be like doing that to them. Guard, guard. What? what? Well, whatever. I got a I gotta bee that needs keeping. Hey, uh, give me your health. No, oh, health! Come back! You know what, you pigmen? You, you're annoying, and you've been doing damage to me. Oh, there's, there's some health bouncing away. I didn't even grab. Um, worth at least once I catch you. Whatever. Yes, you can use fire here. So you don't have to try to jump and use that ability. And a pig again. Can I cut you like this? No. How about a, how about a stun? Would you like to be stunned? Oh! Get juggle stunned. Okay, let, let's look. Let's look very carefully as I use this, how much health it's going to give me. Don't try to pick me here. Ow. Ow. Okay, so they're guarding. So I'm just going to not fight those things. I'm just going just gonna to run past until I find some nice friendly bees that want to give me some health. Or a save point that also would love to give me some health. Oh. What are, what are, oh, this is just backwards. I recognize it, because I was down there before. Save point. Save. Save before boss. Icebound cove. Make, make sure I'm not missing the save point. Come on, save. Be a really great time to, to save. Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, so. Now that we've saved, let's do a little fast travel to town. Well, um, yeah, we'll, we'll do town and buy stuff. Since it seems like I want to own every item anyway. I'll buy the sword and then the shield. And then we'll go on our adventures to uh, break the breakable walls in the other dungeons. And she didn't ask to touch my bracelet. Right, buy equipment, the most expensive you got. Oh, I just don't have enough for that. Oh, whatever. Uh, equip. 
Equip. Upgrade you, man. Upgrade my things. A hundred ore, jeez. If only I didn't have thousands. Um, four strength, really? That's that's what the upgrade does? Oh, sent ten ore, one, or one ore, ten gold. <laughs> so the upgrade's only four strength. That's lame. Oh, whatever, whatever. I'll just get out of here. Alright, so I am going to go ahead and end my video at the save point. Thank you so much for watching. And my hat is off to you.